BBC Radio veteran Tony Blackburn exclusively told Express.co.uk he was thrilled to receive an O for his services to broadcasting and charity after being named in the King's New Year Honours list. BBC Radio 2 presenter Tony Blackburn has opened up about his various encounters with members of the royal family over the years, including King Charles and the late Queen, in an exclusive interview with Express.co.uk. In a wider chat about keeping his home gas safe with Gas Safe Register. The former I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here. Star also shares his joy at receiving an old. In the King's New Year Honours list, it was announced Tony would finally be getting an order of the British Empire after 60 years of radio broadcasting. The DJ, who is being honoured for his services to broadcasting and charity, discussed the flattering moment he found out about the award. He recalled, I was thrilled. I was by myself here in the house when I got this letter through the post saying, you've been nominated for an OB and would you be willing to accept it? And I thought, oh God yes. So that was really quite something, you know. It really was, he added. I knew six weeks before it was announced that I was getting it. Tony went on to reveal that he was forced to keep the exciting news a secret from his family. He shared. I had to keep quiet about it, which I did. In fact, I didn't tell my children until two days before it was announced. It's really very flattering, he added. To get that, it's just lovely to be recognized like that after all this time. Awards like OBEs and MBEs are generally presented in a group ceremony by a member of the royal family, such as King Charles or Prince William. Asked if he hoped to receive the award from a specific member of the royal family on the day, Tony admitted that he probably would have met them already. He explained, Well, I think I've actually sort of met them all over the years. I've met King Charles a few times. And Camilla, now the the late queen, you know, I had a quite long conversation with her, Tony remembered fondly. And I had a really nice evening with Princess Margaret. 